Los Angeles Lakers reserve combo forward Roy Hakimura has not been the automatic energy-shifting scoring option, especially on catch-and-shoot threes, that LA was no doubt hoping for when it offloaded three second-round draft picks and the ghost of Kendrick Nunn for his services in January. Hello my friends, subscribe to the channel and activate the bell to stay on top of all the news about Lakers. That said, he has shown plenty of promising flashes and may be worth retaining as a restricted free agent if the price is right. Across 23 Lakers games this season, he's averaging 10.1 points on .473-.333-.729 shooting splits and 4.7 rebounds a night. In a new episode of the Hoopsite podcast, host Michael Scotto and the Athletics' Jovan Boja unpacked Hakimura's future with LA. After trading away three second-round picks to acquire Hakimura, the Lakers would seemingly have optical pressure to match a potential offer sheet, and they clearly value him as a player, Scotto opined. I think the Lakers are going to try to retain him, Boha suggested. I think his range is around the non-taxpayer MLE. I think something in that 2 20ths or 3 30ths range. Looking at his numbers in Washington versus LA, they're almost identical across the board. I think the Lakers are going to make an offer around $10 million, and if he's looking for more or another team is willing to come in and make a bigger offer, they might be willing to walk away. They were high enough on him to trade those three second-round picks, and they want to keep him. 